Hi, my name is Dave Levin. I'm a sculptor out of Montana. And uh, I used to make my own armatures many years ago. <laughs> Actually, up until just about a year ago. And uh, now I might get my armatures from uh, True, Trueform Armatures. Uh, com. This is one of the 36 inch uh, armatures right here that I'm using on a uh, commission I'm doing of a Captain uh, John Lovewell who uh, was a uh, militia man back in the uh, 1720s in New Hampshire and I'm using True Form as the armature for this and uh, it just saves me a whole lot of time uh, to use a True Form armature. This is their setup that uh, came with the 36 inch uh, figure. This is a half life size. And um, it's just an amazing system. And the fact is, you can remove the head and work on it, which I did. And I can put the head back on, which yeah, I did. And uh, you can cut the, uh, a, a slot where you want to take your arms off and work on them separately because the system uh, allows you to do that. Now, let me. I'll take a moment here and show you the actual armature. This is the true form armature that I'm using on uh, this Captain Lovewell piece. Um, it's uh, 36 inches, like I said. It's half life size, and uh, a lot of people don't understand how to uh, use these. And uh, let me explain the best way to do this without damaging your, your armature. All right, I'm going to show you the armature system on this uh, figure. This is the uh, uh, 24 incher. Uh, as you can see, it has uh, support and all this stuff that comes with the uh, package. You get the board, you get the, uh, the plate that's attached to the board, and then you get all this uh, metal here uh, to uh, uh, mount uh, your, your sculpture. Now, I'll take this off just to show you how this works. The sculpture itself, or the uh, armature itself, comes with two wires that go from the uh, uh, hips up to the underneath the uh, the thorax as you can see there and you can adjust the height and the length of the thorax uh, by just uh, pulling up and down with the uh, thorax in your hand uh, the wires are made so that you can change the length of the waist if you want to um, the arms come off uh, I'm not going to do that uh, these uh, aluminum wires go down to maybe about that deep into the uh, uh, bone and you can just twist a little bit with a little effort and you can take it right off and you can work on the arms separately. Uh, always be careful though when you're you're handling uh, these uh, armatures because they're very durable but they're not indestructible. Keep that in mind always. Not, as, not indestructible. Now there's a slot right here in this uh, rod that goes into the back of the uh, gentleman and uh, the, the armature. And what you do is you take the uh, line up these uh, wires right here in the center of the, uh, in the backbone, and you just push it onto the uh, slot very gently. It goes on easily. Let me get my hands turned around here. And uh, you just put it on there. All right, you got it on the uh, rod. Now you just line up. Uh, the threads with this nut that comes with the uh, armature and you can just screw it down until it hits the uh, backbone of the uh, armature and it locks it in and it's not going to go anywhere. Uh, this is a little loose but that's easy, easily fixed with uh, the wing nut or uh, the nut that comes with it and that tightens that up and then you can tighten up down here and, and keep everything from moving. Uh, if you want to cut down the movement even more you, you can bring up a Put a screw into your, your base wherever you want to and bring it up and then just uh, tie it with a wire or a electrician's tape onto the uh, foot armature just to keep it in position. I would su suggest that anyway because you don't want to uh, have that leg going back and forth while you're sculpting on it anyway. Um, now let's talk about uh, bending the joints because uh, you if you don't bend these properly and carefully you can break them. Now if you break your joint or your bone uh, don't frantic, panic, uh, or frantic, <laughs> don't panic. Uh, you can uh, order a replacement from Trueform. They will just ship them out to you. And uh, what you do is like for the hip uh, uh, area here in the top of the femur, you just uh, take a hold of the uh, joint and hold of the uh, hip 
and just gently, not fast, but just gently and slowly uh, move it. You don't want to break any land speed records uh, bending your bones. Well, that sounds like good health. Oh, never mind. Anyway, uh, then you do the same thing with the uh, joint here. You grab it at the, at the and put your pressure on the uh, joint above and below and slowly bend it and you can bend it uh, at that angle. Uh, the same thing with these bones up here. You, you don't just grab down here and start bending. You want to grab it at the two joint parts and bend it slowly. Now you can change the angle of the thorax uh, any way you want. You can bend it forward, backwards, uh, and the same with the hips. So you can change the angle of the hips to match the pose. You can also you can also adjust the height of the armature support. So if you want the figure closer to the board, uh, you certainly can do that. You know, in a squatting or a sitting position. The possibilities of positioning and uh, poses are just there's no limit. It comes with this board and the plate attached to the board, but you don't have to have it on this board. You can put it on any size board you want to put it on. You can adjust the distance between here and there by just loosening the bolts and uh, pushing the rod back into the support and then tightening it up if you want to. So you can have it on any position you want. All right, um, you can, uh, if you want him coming down a hill uh, or you want him sitting down, um, just Adjust it any way you want to. You can, you can uh, take this off and put it up higher if you want to make one figure higher, and put it on a block of, or two by four with a, a couple two by fours coming straight up, and then just anchor it with that. And uh, like I said, it's 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 what you do with these is just completely up to you. You can do anything you want to. Uh, don't feel that just because it comes on this board, it has to stay on this board. It doesn't. All right, that's uh, the human figure and a simple uh, little lesson on how to bend uh, the uh, armature. It works the same on this as it does on all the figures, uh, the 36 inch, uh, the 20, or the uh, 24 inch like this one, or the 18 inch, or even the uh, 12 inch, which they, they have now too.